Hello my dear students, how are you? I know that you all are safe and fine. Today we are going to learn English general that is our grammar and in that we are going to learn about the types of noun that is our lesson number 3. In lesson number 2 we have learned about the nouns. Let's have a quick recall about the nouns. What is noun? Naming words are called noun. For example, teacher, doctor, park, uh, table, chair, etc. Right? I hope that you have recalled it. Aapko sab yaad aagya hoga abhi tak. Now, in today we are going to learn about the types. Right? In first standard, we are going to learn two types of noun. That is one is common noun and second is proper noun. Let's learn what is common noun. Common noun means general name of any person, place or thing, right? So just have some, let's take some examples about it. That is doctor, teacher, they are common name of person, right? If we say park, that is a common name of place. Here, look at in the picture, he is a doctor. In this sentence, doctor is a common noun. Let's have a look about the second picture. This is a garden or park. It, garden or park is a common noun. It is a na now name of place. So it must be clear about it that common names, common general names are called common nouns. Now let's have a look about the second type of noun that is a proper noun. Proper noun means a very special name. Particular name about a person, place or thing or any uh, place. So it is called proper noun. Let's take some example. My name is Mrs. Roma Christian. I am teacher. In this sentence, Roma is a proper noun. I am teacher. Teacher is a common noun. You must have the name, right? We, are, we don't call you like that a boy, a girl, a man, right? Everyone has a name. So, that is our particular name, specified name, special name which is given to us by our parents and that is called proper noun. In proper noun, let's take some examples. First is, he is, she is teacher, her name is Radha. In this sentence, Radha is a proper noun and teacher is a common noun. Let's take a second example about the, this this is a Hebron Primary School. So in this sentence you can see Hebron is a proper noun and school is a common noun. I hope it is clear with you. Let's take some more example about the proper noun. We can say India is my country. India is a proper noun and country is a common noun. Ganga is biggest, Ganga is the biggest river. Uh, so, in this sentence, Ganga is a proper noun and river is a common noun. So, I think it must be clear to you what is common noun and what is proper noun. Let's take one reca recap of our, let's revise this topic once again. What is common noun? Yes, correct. General name of person or place is known as common noun. Examples? Yes, you are right. Teacher, doctor, school, mother, father, boy, girl, student, uh, park, temple, church, etc. Right? Let's just revise about the proper noun. What is proper noun? Yes, very good. Special name of person or place or thing is known as proper noun. Example about it. Mary, Hebron. Ganga, India, so many names, right? We can say they are called proper nouns. Have you noticed one thing? That common noun is always we write in small letters, begins with small alphabet or letter. Why? Proper noun always begins with capital letter. Have you noticed that? Just have a look about it. Thank you. Now, We'll learn exercises about the common noun and proper noun. Let's have a look. Exercise number one. Circle the common noun in the following sentences. Now you know what is common noun. Yes, correct. General names are called common 
nouns. Just tell me the answers. Number one, tigers live in the jungle. Yes, there are two common nouns in the sentence. Which are they? Correct. First is tigers. Very good. We'll put a circle on it. And number two will be Yes, correct. Jungle. Tiger is a name of animal and jungle is a name of place. Very good students. Now, number two. That shop sells books. Very good. Number one is shop. Shop is a name of place. And which one another one be? Books. Books. Name of things. So, shop and books are common nouns. Number three, the teacher is writing on the blackboard. Good. Very good. Teacher, correct answer. Very good students. Teacher is a name of person. He is writing on the, yes, blackboard. Blackboard is a name of Thing. So, we have learned about the common nouns. See, you have to circle it. Rest of the sentences are given in the PDF format that is on school website. Just you have to write it down from there. Exercise number 2. Underline the proper nouns in the following sentences. Again, what is proper noun we have learned? Yes, specific names are called proper noun. Chalo, come on, number one. Come on, read with me. S-U-R-E-S-H. What it will be? Suresh is a driver. He drives our school bus. Anyone can answer? What is proper noun in this sentence? Yes, it is Suresh. Suresh is the name of proper particular person. For a specific person. Come number two. We are going to OT. Which will be? Yes, we'll underline on OT. Because OT is a particular name of place. Specified name of place. Number three. Mr. Sharma is a policeman. In this sentence? Yes, you are right. Sharma. Sharma is a name of particular person. So, we have learned about the common noun and proper noun. Both the exercises are on school website. Please copy from that as instructed. Thank you very much.